Hey everybody, Nate here. Thank you so much for joining us here for Union City Christian Church's last evening of our Holy Week prayer. Each night this week, we've been going through a different topic and gathering together digitally as a congregation all around our state to be able to pray for some different things. Tonight, we have a prayer request that we're going to send up to the Lord, but we're also going to spend some time thanking Him for His Son and His sacrifice. So tonight's going to be a little bit longer of a prayer than what we've done previously this week. I don't have as much to say on this one. Uh, we're just going to we're just going to pray and be thankful this evening. So thank you guys for joining me. If you want to go ahead and grab your family, we'll jump to it. Lord, we thank you for today. Thank you so much for the opportunity that we have to gather here together, Lord, uh, digitally to pray to you. I want to lift up our churches this morning, Lord, as many are gathering digitally on Sunday, maybe for the first time. Uh, there is this unknown out there. This, this, the sense of normalcy has been taken away as we do digital services and, and as we do all of these different, maybe foreign things, Lord. Uh, I pray for all the churches around the country to be able to have a great service on Sunday. I pray for all the technology to work correctly. Uh, I pray for everything to work smoothly and for the services to be honoring to you and beneficial to those who hear them, Lord. We lift up the prayer, or we lift up in prayer all of our churches who will be gathering in just a couple of days to celebrate Easter, Lord. Lord, we want to thank you so much for sending your son. Uh, we know that it is because of him that we have true life with you. Lord, we want to spend just a moment here thanking you so much for the gracious gift of sending your son to us. As we gather as what is known as Good Friday, Lord, uh, we remember the sacrifice of our Savior. Uh, we remember uh, the pain that he went through on the cross. We remember what will happen and what we celebrate on Sunday morning, resurrection morning. Lord, we want to thank you so much for caring for us to send your Son to go through all of that to die on the cross for us. As we close this evening, Lord, I ask that you prepare our hearts for a service on Sunday morning that would be life-changing. I ask that you prepare our hearts for this Easter celebration for us to truly remember why we celebrate it, even though we can't gather together to celebrate in the normal way, Lord. I ask that you begin to prepare our hearts for the message that Brother Chip will be bringing to us on Sunday morning. Lord, we pray all of these things in your Son's holy name. Amen. I want to thank you guys for joining us this evening. And if you've been tuning in every evening this week, I want to say thank you so much. It's been great to be able to interact with you guys and check in and make sure everything's going okay and just get a little interaction, even if it's digitally. Uh, we want to invite you to share this prayer uh, and share our page to all of your friends uh, this coming weekend as we invite them to join us for Easter. 
Uh, as you know, Easter is one of our biggest Sundays that we have each year. There are a lot of people who attend on Easter who generally don't attend any other time of the year. And we're hoping that this Sunday, this Easter, even though it's online, could be the same opportunity. We invite you to share uh, all of the information for our church out to all your friends who maybe wouldn't necessarily come with you on a Sunday morning, but maybe they'd watch a sermon on Facebook. Uh, we are praying over the this, this sermon and the service that will be being presented on Sunday morning. We hope that you will pray and join us in that. I'll see you guys on Sunday. Thank <music> you.